Peter Tork, who's pretty brilliant, said they probably got a larger audience for this anti-war point of view than even the Beatles did because TV was free and young kids couldn't always afford to buy an album. And the Beatles weren't on TV every week, the monkeys were. So their message got through to those kids on a more regular basis. Who can guess who's Peter Tork sitting with at Monterey Pop Festival? Janis Joplin. There's a whole lot of talk about how nobody took them seriously. <laughs> People in the music business took them seriously because they were selling millions of records. They hung out together. They played music and jammed at each other's houses over the weekend. They were all friends, right? It was the critics who didn't take their music seriously. And as I was discussing before we started, their music has legs and is still around. So the critics were wrong for once.